In the heart of a secluded forest, nestled among towering trees, stood an imposing mansion known as Blackmore Manor. Its dark facade loomed over the landscape, and an aura of mystery surrounded it. One stormy night, a young woman named Isabella received an unexpected invitation to work as a maid at the mansion. Unaware of the family's sinister secrets, Isabella felt elated to escape her humble beginnings and embrace the promise of a better life. With a heart full of hope and anticipation, Greeted by the peculiar smile of Mr. and Mrs. Blackwood, the enigmatic owners. Upon her entry into the mansion, Isabella felt an inexplicable chill run down her spine, as if unseen eyes were watching her every move. Despite the grandeur of the place, she sensed an underlying darkness that gave her pause. Yet she quickly brushed off her unease, attributing it to the storm's influence on her emotions. In the days that followed, Isabella settled into her duties, slowly adjusting to the mansion's eccentricities. The staff, a small group of loyal servants, was tight-lipped and evasive whenever she asked about the family's background or the mansion's history. Whispers among them hinted at a dark secret, but no one dared to speak openly about it. As she delved deeper into her work, Isabella noticed peculiar occurrences around the mansion. The paintings on the walls seemed to follow her with their gaze, and she caught fleeting glimpses of shadowy figures darting through the corners of her vision. But whenever she turned her head to confront them, they vanished into thin air. The oppressive atmosphere only intensified as night fell upon Blackmore Manor. Isabella often heard strange noises echoing through the corridors, like soft murmurs and the shuffling of footsteps. The chilling sounds would raise the hairs on her neck, leaving her with an unsettling feeling of being constantly observed. One night, while preparing a guest room on the top floor, Isabella heard faint chanting coming from a locked room nearby. The voices were hushed, but their eerie melody sent shivers down her spine. She considered investigating further, but a sudden knock on the door startled her, and when she turned back to the locked room, the chanting had ceased. Unnerved, Isabella continued her work, trying to dismiss the peculiar occurrences as mere products of her imagination. However, a lingering feeling of dread clung to her as she struggled to ignore the mounting evidence that something was amiss within the shadowed halls of Blackmore Manor. Did you like the story? Stay tuned for the second part of the story. Join Isabella to discover the secret of the mansion. Like, comment, and share. Thank you very much for watching.